This is a recipe for Queen Drop Biscuits. So after my friend Jess did a 50s recipe with me, she challenged me to do a Victorian recipe. This is from the English Heritage and it's a recipe that was written by a Mrs. Crocombe. If you go to the English Heritage YouTube channel, you can find out all about her. Start by turning on your oven to 180 degrees Celsius. You need eight ounces of butter, eight ounces of sugar, three eggs, eight ounces of currants, and 12 of flour. Cream together the butter and the sugar. At this point I realise I really do need to buy myself a bigger bowl because I was struggling as the butter and the sugar were spursing out the top of the bowl. Add the flour and the eggs and mix well. I ended up adding a fourth egg because my mixture was just too dry compared to Jess's. Given that it's a drop recipe it needed to be able to plop onto the baking tray. Add the currants and mix well. If you're using the almond extract, add it at this point. At this point I realised my mixture was just too dry so I added the extra egg and then it had the right texture. Using a tablespoon, drop tablespoons of the mixture onto a baking sheet. I've got a silicon mat or you could use baking paper. Then put them in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes depending on the size of your biscuits. When they look slightly brown on the outside, remove the biscuits and put them onto a cooling rack. I found it was easiest to do this by using a spatula as they're still a bit soft in the middle when you first take them out of the oven. 